Hey guys, welcome to today's video. Do we have a really good video for you today? We're gonna tour this community of new homes here in Las Cruces, New Mexico. Now, I will share with you at the end the pros and cons of this community. So let's enjoy the video right now. Okay guys, if this is your first time to the channel, you may be wondering, well, why am I wearing a hat? Well, here in sunny New Mexico, it is getting hot. Now, those of you that have seen my videos, you guys have seen I've never wore a hat before. Does it go with me or not? Please comment whether I should not wear the hat or wear the hat. Now, it is sunny. I'm trying to protect myself, but you guys let me know. I don't know you know where you guys are watching i know you guys are watching from a lot of states which is great so but if this is the first time to the channel and you want to know everything about living in las cruces new mexico then subscribe below guys tap that bell for notifications so you can be the first to know about the current market here in las cruces new mexico my name is cesar and my wife is tania and we are getting calls and emails from, from people just like you that are thinking of moving to las cruces new mexico and we absolutely love it so whether you're moving in one week or 12 weeks, give us a call, send us a text, shoot us an email. Now, if you are local here in Las Cruces and you need help listing your home, then reach out to us, please, as well. We can definitely help you out and get your home sold faster with all our viewers in our channel. All right, guys, let's go see these homes. Uh, I'm gonna do something different today. You'll see what it is. Let's go at it. All right, guys, let's go. Let's see, hopefully let's see if uh, we don't fall over here, okay? But uh, let's go see this community. Hopefully you guys can uh, enjoy this drive like I am. I'm actually just going through the community now so we can just see all these homes and talk about them. We'll, we'll get to our first one. Hopefully I won't crash, all right? I'm actually on my scooter today, guys. These are some of the homes right here in the back that we're going to talk about. Um, We'll talk about how big they are, square footage. Stay with me so we can talk about the pros and the cons of this area here in Las Cruces, New Mexico, okay? We're coming up on our first home, guys. Now, there is some lots that are empty, as you can see. There's still empty lots. There's gonna be more homes going up. If you are looking for more, whoa! Well, there goes my hat. Hold on, guys. It is kind of windy today, so. As I was saying, there is more lots available so they can build them for you you can even ask them to build a custom home if you like all right guys this we are at our first house here all right guys so this is the home that we are going to feature today let's see about the size of it square feet first of all let's talk about the size of the lot look at this lot good sized very good size this lot here is 0.28 acres I can't go all the way in there. So this home is listed at $425,000, has around 1,919 square feet, built in 2024, okay? It has three bedroom, two bath with a flex room, which is great. And as you saw, it does have a two car garage. So, I mean, this a good size home good size lot and this is what this community has to offer lots with lots a backyard the backyard the front yard most of me most of your new homes if you guys have seen my videos don't have a lot of lot size but this one does which is great all right let's go so that was the first one let's continue to the next one so we can go ahead and see the rest as you can see guys the, the uh the lots right here right now there's a lot of homes going up we were we are not going to talk about every home that we, we are seeing on the video but these are new homes 
they are selling them and they are selling quick this next home is listed at five hundred and seventy five thousand it has around two thousand seven hundred and forty square feet built in 2024 this year look at the size of this lot guys look at that lot size i'm gonna zoom in on this one right here three car garage this is a five bedroom two and a half bath look at this lot size it is deep now most of these lots are more than a quarter about a quarter of an acre quarter 0.25 beautiful beautiful home this one actually has grass you don't see that this is real grass it's not your fake faux grass let's go to this side and see this home over here see that this one is also being built so yeah guys definitely there's plenty of homes here in las cruces new mexico let's see my next address and let's go It's a little windy, so it's hard to keep my hat on my head today. All right, guys, let's go ahead and go to the next home over here. Guys, a lot of new homes going up here. This next one, let's talk about this next one right here. All right, guys, this is the next home here. This is a three car garage. Very nice home. The list price on this home is 437,800 has around 1,970 square feet built in 2023. This is a four bedroom, two and a half bath with a three car garage. What I like about this home here guys is you don't have any neighbors back here. See that? Absolutely no neighbors. And then you have a huge backyard. I mean, it is it is pretty deep. Remember, you're getting more than quarter about quarter of an acre so a lot of the new houses are probably 0.15 i mean this is almost double the size plus we get a big house right brand new home all right guys let's let's continue going to the next one i believe that one is the next one but let's go ahead and get on our scooter So like I said, guys, they are being built right now as we speak. And uh, let's get in front of this one over here. So this next home is listed at $465,000. This home here, they're working on it now. $465,000, 2,115 square feet. It is a three car garage. And once again, you're on a quarter of an acre, 0.25. Let me just go around so you guys can see how deep this backyard is. Not only do you get a brand new home, new home here in Las Cruces, New Mexico, but in this case, with these homes, you're gonna get, you get your size lot. That's not common with a lot of the new homes, but this one, you will get a large lot. Okay guys, well comment below if you have any comments. Uh, let me know if you are liking the area. Now remember, new construction is not for everyone. If you're willing to put up with the homes being built with trucks and cars coming in and out, then that's great. You want to get in early. I've always said it. Get in early during the building phase. That way at the end of the phase, more than likely your property is going to be worth more money. And that's what usually happens. So. This is a great time if you're thinking of moving to Las Cruces, New Mexico. This is when a lot of people move out. You know, uh, spring is here, summer is coming, and we have a lot of sunny days here in Las Cruces, New Mexico. All right, guys, this is the next home that we are going to feature once again. This next home, guys, is the price on this home is, here we go, 616200 is the price of this home here. 2,718 square feet. This home, you get 0.33 acres. This is one of the larger lots here, and you do get a larger home with the purchase of this lot, which is great. It's a four-car garage. Let, let me show you. Let me show you why it's a four-car garage. You see that big old garage up there? That is for an RV. 
for an RV. Look at the size of that door. So let's say you don't have an RV, then you can put two more cars in there or whatever you like. So you get your two car garage there and then you get, then you get your RV. See that? Beautiful. Okay guys, there, there's a lot of homes here. I'm gonna cruise the community that way. You guys could also see the rest of these homes in the little community here. And then we'll talk about the pros and the cons, okay? So don't leave, please. Did you know 80% of our viewers have not subscribed? 80%, that's a lot of viewers. So please, if you are one of those 80 that have not subscribed, please help us grow our channel. Please subscribe, comment below as well. That way we can grow our channel, okay? Thank you guys for your support. Let's go ahead and drive over there and see the community. Okay, I'm gonna try to face the camera like that so you guys can see. And hopefully I won't lose my hat again. See that more homes right there? We have more lots over here on this side where they will build more homes, which is great. Yeah, see that? More lots, more lots, 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 lots. Lots of lots, lots of lots, right? Lots of lots. Whew, those brakes are gonna end up killing me. All right, there we go. Let's go this way so you guys can see this side of the other houses that are going up right now. See that? Workers are working hard, pressure washing them, getting, ready, getting them ready for you guys. Yeah, so this is the other side of the community. Go ahead and discuss the pros and the cons right here we'll, we'll stand right here and we'll discuss a little bit about the pros and the cons of this community okay okay guys now let's talk about the pros and the cons of this community here let's talk about it but let me just do a quick you guys saw i try to give you footage i don't know if it worked but we'll find out all the all the homes are all back here all right so let's talk about uh pro number one the good the good the bad of this area. Well, the good thing is you're seven minutes from Mesilla Plaza and seven minutes from downtown. So you have food, you have uh, all the amenities you need because you're really close by. So that is a big pro, right? It's good. Okay, pro number two is that you're not in the city. You're farther out, so you have more wiggle room right? Your neighbors aren't too close, so that's great. Now, another good reason in this community is you're very close to I-10. So if you work in El Paso, which El Paso is like from this, from here to going to I-10, to so El Paso is about 45 minute drive, 45 minutes to the west side of El Paso. Downtown is probably about 50 minutes to downtown El Paso. So a lot of you, a lot of people uh, work uh, in El Paso, so they make the drive because El Paso is a big city, you know, way bigger than Las Cruces, New Mexico. The taxes are higher. Property taxes in El Paso, Texas are 3%. So let's do the math. Three, let's say uh, uh, you buy a home for 400,000. 3% of 400,000 is $12,000 on property taxes. Las Cruces, New Mexico, property tax is 1%. So on a $400,000 home, you're gonna be paying about 4,000. Now that's if you live in the city of Las Cruces. If you live further out, then it will be less, okay? All right, let's talk about the last good reason of this community is that you're, you're going to buy a new home. So that means these new houses have warranties. And also it's possible that some of these builders, and I do, I do know some of them, they offer incentives. So you can use that to buy your interest rate down or for closing costs you can't use it as a down payment though. okay guys so now let's talk about the cons all right what are the cons of living in this area okay living in this area con number one is you can barely hear the traffic of the interstate and i can see it i'm going to show it to you right now that is con number one remember we say the good the bad the ugly so that is the interstate and i can see traffic now one of the builders told me that they are willing to build up as much as they can 
according to the building covenants of the area. So that's a good thing, okay? All right, con number two. Con number two is on these homes or any new home here in Las Cruces, you do not get a landscape backyard. They won't do it. They will do the front, zero scape usually, but not the back. But don't you worry, we got people that will do the landscaping for you, so that's not a big deal. You just have to give us a call, send us a text, shoot us an email. That way we can help you with air, with all the move, getting over here, and also getting you into a brand new home, okay? All right, let's go, let's continue. Now the other con is you're not right smack in the middle of downtown. Those of you that just love downtowns and you wanna be in the areas, well, you're a little further out, you will not be able just to walk to get food or anything like that. Okay guys, I, uh, I hope you enjoyed this video. Um, hopefully the scooter thing is gonna work out. If not, it's okay, but I just wanted to try something different. So I really appreciate you guys staying so you guys can hear about the pros and the cons of this area. So once again, guys, give us a call, send us a text, shoot us an email, and we can help you make a smooth move to Las Cruces, New Mexico. We'll see you on the next video.